con. In this video, we will learn what a con is and how to find its volume and surface area. Let's start. A con is a solid that has a circular base and a single vertex, called the apex. If the vertex is over the center of the base, it's called a right cone. If it's not, it's called an oblique cone. Look at the figures alongside. Right cone, oblique cone. The distance from the apex of the cone to the base is the height of the cone. Look at the figure. The length of the cone from apex to any point on the circumference of the base is the slant height. From the figure, we can see that the height, radius and the slant height are connected by the Pythagoras theorem. The slant height can be found using the Pythagoras theorem. When we cut along the slant height, a cone can be broken down into two parts. So the surface of a cone becomes one circular base and one sector of a circle, lateral surface, as seen in its net. The base is a circle of radius r. The area of a circle is given by pi times radius squared. Now look at the area of a circular sector. The lateral surface of a cone is made from a sector of a circle. The radius of the sector is the slant height of the cone. The length of the arc in the sector is the same as the circumference of the small circular base. Remember that the area of a sector is a portion of the area of a complete circle. With this in mind, we can use proportions to find the area of a sector. The ratio of area of a circular sector to the area of the whole circle is the same as the ratio of the arc length to circumference of the whole circle. After simplifying, you get the formula. Finally, adding the areas of the base and lateral surface area, the total surface area is given by this formula. The volume of a cone is one third the area of its base times its height. The volume of the cone is one third of the volume of the cylinder. Let's see how it works. Find the volume and surface area of the following cone. The height is 12 cm and radius is 5 cm. Let's calculate the slant height. Let's apply the Pythagoras theorem. The slant height is 13 cm. Take the formula for surface area. Change the values. Take the formula for volume, change the values. If you enjoyed the content of this video, don't forget to subscribe. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask or suggest anything. I will be grateful for that.